and the developing world. The effects of these changes can be seen everywhere in people's behavior, choice of clothing, food, in language, the arts and culture, and in all aspects of people's lifestyle. To gain a deeper understanding of its effects, we have chosen music as our medium. These musical instruments and their sounds are representations of an ancient culture. These tunes and rhythms carry with them an indigenous sound. They are key identities of entire cultures. And all of these revolve through an ancient country, a country known to be rich in cultural heritage and blessed by nature. A country where the ancient arts can be witnessed in their original form. That country is Nepal. But in the modern era, many of these Nepali tunes and musical instruments are being forgotten by the people of this land. Many of them have all but vanished. Will these instruments now be relegated to a dusty corner in a museum? Do these ancient instruments and tunes still have a place in this ultra-modern world? instruments and music with an interesting modern style while keeping their uniqueness intact. This has brought a new dimension and broadened Deepak's musical horizons. The rhythm band has supported and partnered with Deepak in this journey of his. Now we have Kulukishis, Kumaris, Airas, Ganesh, and the legend of the modern music in Nepal, Deepak Basha Chavia, to take you to the Gandhis of Kumari. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hand together for a Manmagan performance. And I said, Vidal Tanto, Austin, 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 Austin